This is my city. No one threatens Gotham on my watch. Killer Croc is out of control. Let's play Green Arrow to KO Croc so we can take out Grundy for good. Game over, Grundy. That was the end of Solomon Grundy. Thanks for the help with Grundy. Before we try to take on Dr. Quinn, Art. yeah, yeah, I've got it, Bats. The device is almost ready, Ooh. And I've arranged things so Superman will take all the blame. What? Hello? I'm Harley! Sorry, I can't let you guys just destroy Gotham. Besides, there's an amazing taco joint on 8th. Ooh, you just gotta try their house guacamole. Enough rambling. It's time for the fun to begin. The Joker and Lex Luthor are working together. We'll have to defeat both of them to win this battle. Luckily, we have backup as well. Each turn, we gain access to resources that we can spend to play cards. Use our bronze resource to play Catwoman. Hmm, we've used all our resources this turn. Robin will have to wait until- <laughs> That's the spirit, Baldy! Let's show these- Our resource from last turn has replenished, and we've gained a second one. We can play both our recruits this turn. Make sure to attack with Captain before ending your- Take that, you jerks! One of our resources has been upgraded to silver. We can spend it to play Nightwing. Recruits are not the only cards we have to rely on to win the game. Actions, unlike recruits, don't get played to the battlefield, but instead give us a one-time effect to help us win the battle. Looks like we've drawn two bronze cards. Even though we don't have any bronze resources, you can always use a higher tier resource to play a lower cost card. We can use our silver resource to play either card. Hey! You're gonna pay for that! This is bad. Brainiac's forces are overwhelming us. One of our silver resources upgraded to gold. From this point forward, we'll have a silver and a gold resource to use each turn. I'm going to leave it to you to take down the enemy leaders. You got here just in time, cyborg. You 
you guys are in trouble now! Phew, I'm glad that's over with. Now, it's taco time! That's not how I expected that. I just received an alert from a friend up north. We should give him some help. Then, maybe he can walk you through this game. Hurting a sweet little plant. Put I can't plant let you do down, it. Ivy. Did you not realize this? <laughs> Looks like you're ready to see what a real battle in DC Dual Force is like. One last lesson is utilizing leader abilities. All leaders have a charge ability. Each turn, your leaders will gain a charge. Once they've accumulated enough charges, you can spend them to activate that leader's ability. Activating Superman will give him seven power and make him invincible for the turn. When I'm invincible, I can't be damaged or KO'd by enemies. Every leader's charge ability is unique, so make sure to investigate each one, including our enemies, to see what they're capable of. Make sure to play your cards before ending your turn. Looks like you've drawn a recruit with shield. Shield will protect a character by absorbing all of the damage from the next hit they would take. Then the shield goes away. Make sure to play your cards before ending your turn. Make sure to play your cards before ending your turn. Nature, wonderful. Ivy's vines have a special ability. Zoom in on them to read. I'm ready to use my charge ability.
My gadgets are free. Pick one to add to your hand. In addition to the gadget, I can also attack this turn, just like our recruits. ready to use his charge ability. You should use him to KO Giganta. You monsters. Have you no shame? Could not have done it better myself. Deadly. No! I will fight on for you. 